concert for our band program at Maribel High School. I'd like to uh, say a special thank you to a few people very quickly here. And, uh, one of those directors that has been working with our groups is Sean Schutz. He works with our percussion. Uh, Mr. Travis Green is at our middle school. Uh, Ms. Rowan Robines has been working with us on a weekly basis and we appreciate it with her. And Mr. Hayden uh, works with our intermediate school students and especially our private teachers. Uh, they do a, a tremendous job working with our students. And uh, it's, a, it's a big, it's a, a lot of fun. It's a big pleasure, I would say, to say, uh, to work with these folks on a daily basis and weekly to see them interacting with our students. Uh, the first tune that you heard was written by Gary Gilroy. And some of you may remember that name. A few years ago, Mr. Hayden uh, took a group to uh, the Midwest Clinic and uh, commissioned a piece by Gary Gilroy. Uh, does anybody remember the name of that team? <coughs> yes. Um. <laughs> she didn't think I would actually pick on it. Odd eye. Okay, think about that. Okay. Thank you. Three stars of Tennessee is a feature piece, so. Uh, Mr. Gilroy is, uh, does a great job with compositions and uh, he writes a lot of music, marching band also, so we're, we're excited. He's obviously a percussionist, as you can tell from all the music percussion instruments. Well, the next, next tune is uh, one that you'll recognize and some of us claim the Scottish heritage. Uh, I hope that's true, it's, it's a lot to be said for that. This is a, a beautiful piece and uh, it's arranged by one of our favorite people, Miss Frank Tekele. I hope you enjoy this.
proposing to play at least a couple, if not three or four, pieces of their literature. Uh, this year we picked a gentleman by the name of John Barnes Chance, and I realize that a lot of people don't know who he is, and uh, in, even in the band literature world, there's uh, nowadays several people that don't know who he is. But uh, in his time, John Barnes Chance in the late 60s was uh, really on the cutting edge of writing tremendous band literature, and, and he had a tragic death early in life, and so we lost a, an opportunity to have even more of his literature. But the two pieces that we're playing from John Barnes Chance tonight, uh, one from this group and then the other group, are his premier pieces, if you will. And uh, there are colleges across the country that uh, just really can't wait to play this piece of music. And, and we're really encouraging other high schools to also play this music. It's engaging, it's fun, it's creative, it's beautiful in so many aspects, and it's tricky. It's very tricky. So uh, I'm really proud of our groups this uh, semester and what they've been able to do with uh, the, this first piece is Incantation and Dance, and then you'll hear variations on Korean folk song. And this is by John Barnes Chance.
session ensemble will prepare and they will play. So just a few minutes. <laughs> 